Hello everyone, welcome to episode two of Chance Snacks. I know I said last time I wasn't sure if I'd be doing episodes, but here we are, two weeks later. So, thank you so much for coming back, or maybe it's your first time here. Chance Snacks, what we do is we just take little bits of uh, chance that we can use in our daily life to hopefully inspire heightened energy of these different gods and goddesses so that we can therefore take it into the world, hopefully better our lives and better everybody else's lives than around us. So this week we will be digging a little, a little snack into Lakshmi, the goddess of abundance, the goddess of wealth, the goddess of Mm -hmm. all good things that come with luck and fortune and not just she's not just the goddess of external wealth or external luck but she is also the goddess of heightened good health of love of beauty internal beauty and external beauty generosity gratitude attitude self-esteem and I could just keep going on and on and on. A lot of times in mythology you'll see her see her portrayed a piece of Venus but not fully and she's pictured sitting on a lotus. Sitting on a lotus, holding lotuses, garlands of lotuses, so lots of lotus flowers. What we know about the lotus is it grows in the murk. It grows in the mucky water and then rises to the top and what this really signifies are the different stages of our personal evolution and particularly the abundance we can gain from perseverance, patience, and grace. Some things I know I work on in my daily life, so she is one that I hold dear to my heart. And what I love, wrote Rumi has this quote that very much can be attributed to the idea of Lakshmi, let the beauty of what you love be what you do. There are many ways to kneel and kiss the ground. So devotion, love, abundance, all the good things that come with perseverance and patience and grace. Things I love to consider with Lakshmi that I actually borrowed from my beautiful goddess, Sally Kempton, my favorite book for any goddess work, Awakening Shakti. There's two things to consider. In what ways do I experience abundance? And what do I experience as beautiful within myself, others, and the world around me? Mm, so much good stuff. So the chant that we'll learn for Lakshmi today is super simple. A little, a little more, um, not necessarily advanced, but a few more words for the Ganesh one that we learned two weeks ago. So we'll start, it starts with Om, as all chants do, the awakening, the sound, the eternal source. Namo is a salutation, all glory to Lakshmi, we just learned, goddess of abundance. Prema, Prema means love. Devi means goddess, and combined together, Prema Devi is the goddess of love. And Ma Taji, the final word, Ma means mother, and Taji, the end just means a respect. I bow to you. So essentially, we are incorporating and evoking this beautiful energy of Lakshmi, the goddess of love, abundance, so that we may call that abundance and grace in our life as well. So I'll chant it a few times. Would love for you to join me or perhaps just listen, observe the sounds, the vibrations. That's the best part about chanting is really being able to hold it within. Take a tall seat wherever you are. Feel your tailbone draw back and pull your belly and ribs up and in. From here, take a breath in. And breath out. And perhaps you even envision yourself sitting on this lotus flower. And this representation of the murk. The suboptimal things, the lessons we may go through so that we may experience abundance within and without. And I'll start. You can join me whenever you're ready. Om Namo Lakshmi 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 Om Namo Lakshmi
with your palms facing upwards to gain all the abundance, inspiration, beauty, and joy the goddess has to give. Take a breath in and take a breath out. Slowly open your eyes if they are closed. Friends, thank you so much for joining me. Please always and forever leave comments. Let me know who you want to learn. We've got a few on deck coming up, so let me know what you want to learn, how you want to experience it, and what feedback you have. Share with your friends. This is how we get the beauty of sound into our lives and the vibrations to enhance the world. Thank you, everyone. Have such an amazing day. I hope to see you soon.